let's see here. Yay. So, um, yes, I'm so excited. So this is our new team Zoom. I figured, I thought Friday at 11 is perfect because we meet with Tracy. Um, everyone meets with Tracy at least on Mondays. And then some of you are doing the diamond run. So you're also meeting on Wednesdays. And so this kind of completes the week. So, but not like suddenly just all letting our businesses fall to the wayside. We're like going to stay consistent and like, and bring it in through the weekend because Fridays is a good day to prepare for what? <laughs> Saturday morning, oh, business opportunity calls. So Mary Beth Fleming's calls officially ended. And so I'm taking that over um, and happy to like, and it doesn't mean I'm taking it over. It means I'm starting a new series of business opportunity Zooms um, for health and wealth. And it's a balanced message. It's all about understanding that people are having a whole life transformation. This is an opportunity because I personally think that the best product we offer is what? The business. <laughs> I know I was watching you guys say it. <laughs> yeah, the best opportunity we have really is the business. This is it's so it's so amazing. I just got through spending like two days with these amazing women who are some of them are on the call. Um, Tirza's team, Natalia was there, um, Tirza, Afi, Melissa, and our other we were celebrating our friend Devin's 50th birthday, and we had such a beautiful time. We did like a ritual, we just really brought it in so strong. And I just love these ladies, and I just it was I was just really reminded how awesome it is to work in community and that we get to have each other. And then some of us get to see each other once a year at convention. And like, how many of you were at convention and just was like, oh my God, my new community. Right? Yeah, like like we just get to really connect and um. And right now it's all women on the call and we are mostly women. Um, and how, how powerful is that? We love our men too. And they get to be surrounded by powerful women and be reminded like how incredible women are. Um, and we get to be reminded like how awesome men are that they can support that kind of a container. So <laughs> it's a win-win. Um, but yeah, I really just felt, I, I just been feeling like there's so many new brand partners on here. Um, Natalia and Emily just joined the team, like pretty much right about the same time. And some of you have joined this year and Emily joined with Lisa, her mom. So Lisa, say hi, Lisa. And uh, Lisa, oh, how's your neck? Are you like sitting there nursing your neck? Oh, honey. All right. I have, I have a treat for you. I'm going to, I'm going to talk to you about it later, but I think I might be able to help you with some of that. Um, so anyway, this is just a thriving, thriving team. We're expanding. I count, somebody asked me the other day how many brand partners I had. I get that question a lot and I never really looked. I have over 500 brand partners. I mean, it's crazy. <laughs> and so of course, not all of them are as active as some of you. And, and even this isn't even our full group of active people. I mean, there were, I had 26, 26 of you came with me to convention from Team Alchemy. And so that that just shows that there are still a good number of people who are actively doing the business together. And I want to support all of you to get to a next rank. And what we're all heading for is Diamond Club, which is in LA. And it's this November, November 15th weekend. And it is a paid trip. You pay for your own way to LA but the actual hotels are paid, the hotel is paid for, for, all the food is paid for, there's amazing training, you get to see the facility, you get to really experience the heart of Amy and Dave. It's like convention, only more intimate, and it's, you know, and it's for those of you who um, reach Diamond. And so I know that um, pretty much all of you would like to rank Diamond. Who would like to rank Diamond? Am I right? Anyone want to rank Diamond? <laughs> yes, okay. So. Um, diamond is when you, is really like the first rank that is a consistent paycheck. That's like, you can depend on $1,500 a month minimum and actually start to move towards the next rank, which is then green diamond, which is around 2,500 to $3,000, $4,000 a month. Um, like, you know, you start at 1500 in, in diamond and then it, and then it goes up until you, then you hit green diamond. So that paycheck keeps going up until you hit green diamond, which is then a check of, you know, for around, can go up to like around $4,000 and then up to five. And then you've got blue diamond, which is around $6,000. So blue diamond is where you really can have like a full-time income 
with this company and like really be paying, you know, your bills. And then, um, and then it gets up to black diamond, which is $9,000 a month. Um, and then red diamond, which is 12 or 13,000 a month. And then crown, which is 15,000 and then two star crown, which is 18,000 and so on. Right. And What's really amazing is that the people who actually like stay close to the fire start moving through the ranks and staying close to the fire means coming to these types of calls so that you get, so you're inoculated, you know, with the, I'm using that my mycelium, the, the mushroom analogy, you know, mushrooms like inoculate. There's like this, there's this like contagion that happens. You get in some mindset and that mindset keeps you moving forward in your business, getting ideas from each other, like, oh, how can I do this? How can I do that? How can I enroll this person? How can I enroll that person? How, what is the, what is, what are the tools? What are the resources? What do I say? Right? So these calls are a place where you can come and be by the fire and ask those questions and say, oh, I had like a challenge with this one person or, oh, I have this in the idea to do this. How do I do it? How do I execute this idea? How do I do a tabling event? And um, and so on. So these Friday Zooms are really going to be an opportunity to receive personal coaching in a more intimate setting, as well as um, help your brand partners, your new brand partners, get the information and you to actually get more clear in the information and learn how to even deliver that information. So what I wanted to do today is, um, first of all, welcome the new people and uh, I see that Natalia is driving and I see that Emily has got her baby asleep. So we'll just say hello and you guys will have a chance to talk in the future and we'll get to hear from you. Um, but I would love to hear, or or if you guys feel like sharing anything right now, what I'd really love to hear from anyone, you two, you two first, if you if you feel like sharing, is what is inspiring to you about doing the business with Perium at this moment in time. And it can be from anyone. Like, Anyone can answer this question. So I'm just opening up the call to like a few of you to share what is inspiring you now. And you can just pop off mute and popcorn. I can share. Who is that? This is Dana Lynn. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Dana, yes, please. I am inspired by the values of this company. I'm inspired by how much they match mine. I'm inspired by how much these products can enhance someone's life, both from the health and wealth aspect. Uh, they can be such a solution for so many things. I'm inspired by standing more confidently in that alignment and sharing boldly um, about how I feel about this opportunity. Um, I'm inspired to table because I love meeting people face to face. Awesome. And you're doing, and you're doing a tabling event with Natam Kaur. Right. It's, it's a small local event she, because she's kind of a neighbor of mine and it's, but it's in my community center that I run. So there'll be like a hundred people here and um, I'm going to table at her event. I asked her how she, if she was okay with it. She said, yes. So my husband and I, and maybe my daughter are all going to table here. And in the process, um, I also found a friend who knew about Purium that I didn't know knew about Purium. She's going to come and share a little bit about her experience. So I'd love to unpack that a little bit with you, Rachel, if we have time on this call. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, um, right. And I'm understand. I'm remembering the context. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, who here has done a tabling event? So far, I just recently did one. Okay, all right, cool. Some of you have done so, um, and we all have the new version, which we just learned from Ra and Carolina at the Pyram convention. They had such a great model of how to do it. And one of the things I'm curious about is, did everybody follow up with all the people at the event? If you followed up with everyone, raise your hand. Okay, so it's, it, this can happen where you have all these leads and you don't follow up. And as we say, the fortune is in the follow-up and that follow-up ideally happens seven times. 
And so it's not just the first time you start that conversation, but just remember you want to have like, there's going to be seven ways that you can follow up. It can be a call, an email, a text, an invitation to another, um, an invitation to like this weekend, the Saturday morning call. It can be the invitation to a healthy happy hour. And by the way, we have a healthy happy hour tonight. That's um, that Emily uh, is Emily's launch party. So if anyone has anyone to invite to her call, it is today at five Pacific time, eight Eastern. You're welcome to invite anyone who's curious about um, the transformation, the 90 day to come to that call and we'll share stories and inspiration. So just remember the fortune is in the follow-up. I can't emphasize that enough. And that is why we, I also started doing like the follow-up Fridays. We didn't do it this morning because I wanted this call to be primary. Um, but I, I think I am going to continue with those um, before this call to like have follow-up before the call. But this is really the team call right here. And what I want to talk about today because we have new people and I think I want to reiterate this because I think we've lost sort of the system a little bit of like, how do we enroll people? What is the method of getting a person interested all the way through getting them enrolled? So how, do, what is that journey? What is that funnel? Okay, so the funnel is what I want to talk with you guys about today. And so we know it as the game plan. It's an acronym, G-A-M-E. Now, some of you already know the acronym. Some of you all know the tools, but you might have forgotten what the tools are. <laughs> okay, I'm noticing this. I'm noticing that there's some forgetting of like, how, how do we move them through? So G is the first step and G is going public. And going public can look like a lot of things. One of them is having a table event. You're literally in public, okay? But going public is all about sharing stories in a place where it can be seen. And that is usually social media, sharing not just your story, but sharing other people's stories and showing your story along the way. So some of you are, maybe have have already done a 90 day and some of you are just in the middle of a 90 day or have just started a 90 day. And some of you who've already done a 90 day will do another 90 day. And so there's always an opportunity to show the journey again. I'm on day one, I'm on day three, I'm on day five, I'm 10 days in, I'm 45 days in. Like showing your trajectory and letting people see the results along the way. So many people wait to post about their transformation until they're done. They're like, when I get to that goal, like imagine if when I won my medals on stage, if I never posted about my journey and I just suddenly was like, you know, like, oh, you know, life is rough. And then all of a sudden one day I'm like, I'm on the stage and I've transformed. Like that's definitely going to get a lot of attention. People wonder like how I got there, but I'll have missed this entire journey because people join you during the journey. When they just see even a little result, wow, I got a little more sleep last night. People are going to be like, what? You got sleep? I'm dying to sleep. I'm struggling to sleep. I need to sleep. How do I sleep? How do I get there? How do I get to sleep? That is what I call the golden hour. In photography, we talk about the golden hour, which is that prime time where it's like the sun is setting and it's beautiful color and everyone's skin glows and it's just a beautiful time to take pictures. That first 30, 60, 90 days of your journey is the golden hour. You're showing people your rebirth as it's happening. And every little detail is gonna capture a different part of your audience. Some of your audience could use more sleep. Some of them could use more energy. Some of them want to change, want to either gain weight or lose weight. Some of them would like to change their digestion. Some of them would like to feel better just in their moods, would like to feel a better um, 
sense of their purpose. Some people just want to have, get out of depression, get out of a funk. Some people are just feeling weighed down by all their stuff and they just need to cleanse everything, not just their bodies. They need to like cleanse their households. They're ready for spring cleaning. So this golden hour journey is precious. And every time you do it is an opportunity to be sharing publicly. And you also get rewarded by the company. So as you share that journey, you can send those videos into the company or those before and after pictures into the company. And that can give you 300 points a month, up to 600 points a month, which is amazing when you have a whole team getting those points a month, when everyone is getting those points together. Like I'm looking at tears and I'm thinking like, tears is running for diamond this month. <laughs> She's going for diamond, right? Yeah. So imagine to get 15,000 points, if everyone on our team is posting and submitting those points, that's 600 points for every team member, every brand partner, that adds up. That can be a few thousand points for her this month that can make a huge difference, plus your own points. And then if, and then if Tears is also going public and sharing videos, that's teaching her team how to do the same. They're going, oh, that's how you do it. Oh, that's what you say. Oh, all I have to do is just do a video of my self blending my shake. This could be your video this morning. Oh, it's not blending. I don't know. For some reason, it's not running. But anyway, if I just film myself blending this and saying nothing, that's a video. That's going public. That's something you can turn in and submit for points. Me taking my aminos, me showing my aminos, me just doing any part of the process, that's all going public. That is all something that goes into a person's subconscious. They may just see it one day and go, huh? And then the next day they see you do your green drink and they're like, well, what is that green drink you're drinking? And then people just start asking questions because now they're starting to see you do something, a whole new routine in your life that they're being witness to. And now they're curious and then they're going to start interacting with you or asking questions. And then everything starts to make sense along the way. Hey, so Rachel. I, yes. I'm sorry to interrupt you, but would <laughs> you mind just talking briefly about that point system like do people need to do it daily do they have to do it by the by friday every week how do they can you talk about that a little bit because i need to get on top of that i haven't really been on top of that perfect okay i also see that dana lynn's hands up did you want to say something also dana lynn and then i'll go it had to do with widen your reach and and share because you care and how they could integrate and whether we could talk about um, how, so I haven't done my share because I, you care and I'm, I'm pretty sure I wanna understand the details of how it changed. So it had to do with all of it. Okay, great. So what I'm gonna do to visually help you guys understand this is I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to uh, <clears throat> go to Facebook. Where, this, where the information is. And it's in Next Level Gold Jumpers, all the slides. And so if you're on Facebook and you are not on Next Level Gold Jumpers, we'll get you in there. But it was posted, let's see, here it is. These are all the promos right here. And so Mary Beth, who was a two-star crown, posted these. Um, here are the promo updates and let me find the share because you care one. So here are all the different ways that you can accrue free points. We call them free points and I say no points left behind. Okay. So every Friday by 10 o'clock Pacific time, your points have to be submitted. And then the next week you cannot submit things from the week ago or two weeks ago. You can't submit anything after Friday. So you have to start new points over in terms of share because you care and widen your reach. Now, this looks like a lot of jumble on the screen. So for some of you, this is gonna be just like overwhelming and this is not helpful to look at a bunch of garbage on the screen. Like to me, this just looks like garbage on the screen. So <laughs> I'm gonna focus your attention to one thing at a time. And that's the bottom here. Promos for selective rank advancers. Right down here. So widen your reach on the left. One submission, widen your reach is purely videos. It can be a reel, it can be a story, 
It can be a video you upload onto Facebook. It can be a video anywhere on any social media, LinkedIn, it doesn't matter. But it's a video which you take a screenshot of to, to show that you did the video. You go into your back office and you submit it and don't worry about how, okay? Don't worry about that stuff because that stuff's easy once you get it. I just want you to understand the what. So right down here, we're only looking at this, widen your reach. So one submission is 33 points. You can, you can, you can submit a maximum of three per week for 99 points. You can do more than three, but you can only submit three. And so that's how you get 99 points a week, which in four weeks is 400 points. You know, or 396. <laughs> now, if you do 10 lives in a month, you also get an extra 100 points. So that can be 500 points a month that you can get just from submitting videos. Okay. Any questions about that? And feel free to come off mute if you have questions because I can't see you guys. So the way that they were explaining it was a little bit crazy because I, the way I understood it to be was that like, if you, if you, if you were a brand partner after a certain time frame that this, I don't know. It, it was like yeah. confusing. Let, there... let, me, let me explain it. First of all, if you are a brand new brand partner, so this would apply to like Natalia and Emily who are brand new. If you do 10 in your first 10 days, you get a hundred points. So you're, those are the only people who get points for doing 10 in the first 10 days. So you can get a hundred points for that. Now, okay, there's, a there's a, sorry, go ahead, Lisa, or whoever that was. I was going to let Lisa finish her, her question, but um, in the, um, in the chat, um, Natalia is asking, where do you submit to? So there's, okay. is there a possible way that's, that you, Rachel, can send a link for people that don't know? It, it's basically you go into your back office, right? I'm going to show you right something, now. There's something that a page that says like widen your reach or something. Can you yeah. post that on our group chat so people that don't know new brand partners and people that don't know where to do this? Because that was one of the challenges for me um, when I first figured this out but basically now I just set an alarm on my phone on like Thursday because it, this has to be in by Friday by midnight and then it's just a reminder to myself you know hopefully you're not just doing it all on Thursday but it's a reminder that like I the videos that I've created throughout the week I need to screenshot and then send them mm. to okay yes so here is the back office so this is backoffice.mypurium.com this link is on your boards app, but you can also just memorize this link or just save it. Or if you go to iShopPurium.com, there's also a link to your back office from iShopPurium.com if you log in. There's many ways to access this. I have it. Yeah. I found that it's really easy. You just remember back office because it's a back office and then you just right? look in. Yeah, backoffice.mypurium.com. You can save it um, to your home screen. You can save it to anywhere. I want to welcome Yama. <laughs> to the call. And just so you know, Yama, we're going over um, some, a little bit of stuff that probably you won't care about too much right now, but <clears throat> we will, we are talking about the, the method for helping a person get interested in sharing them and moving them through the funnel. Okay. That said, so here's the back office and I want you to just look across the top of the screen. There's all these different tabs. The last one is submission forms. Okay. So if I click submission forms, these are the things you can submit and there's widen your reach right there. And if you click widen your reach, it's gonna now have a type form. It's gonna explain to you, enter all the details for your presentation here to earn GQV points. That just means group qualifying volume. These points will be awarded to the brand partner who is linked to this premium back office. Maximum of three widen your reach lives per day will be counted. And now what they mean is it's it's a maximum of three per week, but say you don't upload any of them till Friday, that's, you can't upload more than three in a day. If you're doing 10 in a week, if you're doing 10 in 10 days, 
and you try to upload all 10 on the last day, it's not going to work. So you can do a maximum of three. You can upload a maximum of three per day. But I just recommend, you know, just focus on everyone else is going to be doing three per week. And right now, anyone who's executive or above, this is open again. Widen your reach is open. So when you rank executive, then you're going to be able to do this again. So this is um, widen your reach is usually just for people in their first four months. Anyone in their first four months can do widen your reach. But now anybody who's an executive or above, you can start again. You can actually, this is open to you again. This is available to you to help you get to Diamond. And you just click start and just answer all the questions, okay? So I'm gonna go back to submission forms. I'm gonna click it again. And then we're gonna go down to share because you care. This is where you share, submit your share because your care points. So these are for picture posts. These are static posts. So widen your reach is for video and share because you care is for pictures. And the pictures are before and after stories, a story of person's before and after experience. It doesn't have to be their before and after picture, like as in like a full body picture. It's just, it's just posting stories of people who've had success with the protocol. And so the same thing, you click on it and there's a type form and you're just gonna post, you're gonna submit the picture, a screenshot. So all of these places where you submit are just where you submit screenshots. So for widen your reach, you're gonna submit a screenshot of your video, plus you're gonna submit the link. You just click the share button from your, from your, from the, image sorry you click you're going to share the actual post now just so you guys know these are loosely monitored it's very much a gentlewoman's honor system okay don't freak out about did i picture you know don't worry too much about the details do your best to answer the questions if it's like you know what time did it happen i don't know 9 a.m guess right? They're not going to go and look and make sure they don't care about all the details. They just want to know you did it. Okay. Is that helpful to know? <laughs> just do your best to answer the questions. Don't make it a big deal. And the more you do it after you've been doing it for a couple of weeks, it's like totally second nature. It's just really easy. Okay. Um. These, so those are the easiest way to get points, anybody who's an executive above can do that. And anyone who's in their first four months can do it. And then once you rank up, you're, anyone who ranks up, you're enabled, you're, this enables you to also um, do the widen your reach and share because you care. You can submit three per week. So we, let's look at share because you care for a moment. Please have all three screenshots of a product or business success post that you shared on social media from this week. So in other words, submit them all at once and you can post them all at once. You can post three in your stories all at once. You can post three on your Facebook page all at once. You can post, and these stories can be a picture of a person's face with their written story with their, with, with like three bullet points, or it could be their before and after photograph of their body. Um, it could be a photograph of like my face sharing my story about my business, for instance. So these are the kinds of things that they talk about. That's what they mean. And so this is basically, and you, in order to do any of these, you have to have a smart order. Okay. If you want to get free points, it's required that you have a smart order, which is just a monthly automatic automated order that's on file. And you can get 50 points for submitting these three. Yes, Dana Lynn. So I share because you care. I get so bored of posting, just posting and not having like a relationship to the story. So could we some Friday or could we have, I know that boards is doing a funky thing where you have to pay. So right now I don't have access to team alchemy. So I don't know if anyone else feels this way, but I would love to do some creative things with share because you care as a team, if we could. So that we have, like, I have some that I would be happy to share and it's, you know, and 
like hear about some stories that would be fun to share rather than just posting and not really having a relationship with it? Let me show you another place. Yes, you guys are welcome in the accountability thread to share stories there and and and, and use those. There's also they're also in the team boards app under before and after. There's some pictures there. But let me show you another resource. Here's what I would like. Here's what I'm going to request of all of you, okay? The Core 4 Nutrition Launch Group is our prospecting group. This is the best place to post your stories before and after. So rather than just posting them in the team thread, post them in here, and then you can let the team thread know I posted my story in there. You can share this, your post from here into the team thread. Um, but for instance, another example of a video is Isaac interviewed Michelle. Or actually, here's a here's Michelle viewed interviewing Dr. Isaac here. This is a resource created on August 15th that you can share with people. He talks about the business, he talks himself about this his success as a doctor with the business of Perium as well as the health of Perium. He shares both stories. Okay. It's a it's a balanced message. So in this group, post your before and after stories. And you can also take posts, take before and after stories from this group into your post them on your feed. You can take screenshots in here. You can borrow pictures and stories from in there. You can take screenshots and then just post them on your page. Okay. Sound good? There's some interesting things in here that are I'm tripping off on. I'm like, okay. Anyway, so um, yeah, the, all kinds of stories here. Here's a PCOS story with Tall being interviewed by Dave Sandoval. Um, her recovery from PCOS. So you can do a search for anything in here. Um, maybe you want to do, you know, a post of someone losing weight. You can take a picture. Um, you can just download these screenshots. Um, and or you can share these actual videos, and then now you've shared a video. Okay. So is that helpful? If you don't know about this group, Core 4 Nutrition Launch Group, this is a group that's been going for years. There's 20,000 members in here and we have um, we have millions of stories. You can do a search on the, here on the search bar inside the group and just do a search for diabetes. Oops, I spelled it wrong. Diabetes, well, even I spelled it wrong, it still came out correctly. And there's my cousin, my cousin's best friend, Del Racer, and she shares her diabetes story. So you can, here's a video about diabetes recovery. One of our friends, one of the people from our team, Carl, recovering from diabetes completely, no longer diabetic. Here's somebody who had celiac, who recovered from celiac. Here's, and so the other thing you can do is you can, this is also part of going public, right? You can invite any of your prospects or friends or whoever's struggling, you need them to get some inspiration. You can invite them into this group and tag them in any post related to their issue. If their issue is diabetes, do a search for diabetes. I'm on the left here. The search bar is on the left now. If they if they have Lyme, do a search for Lyme. And by the way, it's Lyme without an S on the end. It's Lyme. And then here's some stories of people recovering from Lyme. You can invite them into the group and then you can tag them in these posts. Here's my story of recovering from Hashimoto's. So you can use it to this guy who was on dialysis and... Um, um, was able to make some improvements. So there's all kinds. Here's another li Lyme story with Dr. Dana, who's um, a Lyme doctor. And yeah, like you can just go on and on about Lyme. So this is a resource for sharing with people any information related to their issues um, about Purium. Now, is there any questions about this? I'm going to go ahead and actually post the link to this in the group. I can figure out how to get back. <laughs> okay, I can't see the chat, but if anybody, if there's anything in the chat for me, just let me know. I'm going to go ahead and put this group in the chat. Stop sharing for a moment. Okay, there you go. So that's going public. 
interviewing each other is a great way to go public on social media. Literally, you can share an, an Instagram live together. I can interview near I can interview Diana Lynn talking about it. I can interview <laughs> I can interview Diana telling her health story of recovering from Hashimoto's. I can interview um Shri um talking about her recovery from uh Hashimoto's and her husband's recovery from pain, as well as her um earning income and doing what she loves, just being inspired to share both you know, the whole lifestyle transformation, um, et cetera. Okay. So interviewing people is another way to go public. So going public is vast. There's a lot of things you can do. And then also having a healthy, happy hour at your house. I would say healthy, happy hours are probably one of the main ways I grew my business is having a healthy, happy hour at my house where I invite a bunch of friends. I have um, other friends come and share their stories and testimonials. Like we come together share our stories and talk about the products. And it's just like any of those presentations um, in the, sorry, I'm trying to like come back to gallery view. Um, just like any of the presentations that are, uh, that are in our app, which brings me to the app. So one thing I want to say about game, about G, about going public, the purpose I can't emphasize this enough, okay? People, yeah, I do it in person, yes. <laughs> the people who, so many often, so often it's easy to talk about the products and talk about the products first and you lose people. Oh, hey, I know about this pro protocol that can like totally help you. There's the super aminos that do this and the cherry juice and do this. If you're doing that, you're coming from your head. You're coming from a cerebral place and you're doing, you're, you're talking about facts. Facts tell, but stories sell. This is why we focus on telling stories and not talking about the products. Stories are what inspire people. Stories are what inspire people to even consider transforming because they see themselves in the story they can imagine feeling how you felt or your friend felt or your uncle felt or your dad felt or your mom felt your kid felt they can relate to someone's experience and so when we lead with the story that's when they finally will start to really but let down their guard and then they'll start to ask you questions about how you or that person recovered. We have to earn the right to talk about products. We have to earn the trust to talk about products. Okay, this is a trust thing. We're building trust with people and the stories build trust. That's why we share stories when we go public. When you do a healthy happy hour, you're also sharing stories. Have you ever noticed that every presentation on the Q&A app, on the Q&A boards inside the Team Alchemy boards app, every single presentation starts out with three stories. I don't even talk about the products. We don't talk about any of the products until we've had three stories. Because no one's gonna wanna, people will be like, oh, it costs $400. Oh, forget it, I'm not interested. Why? Because they they haven't the value is not built yet. The value is not there. A number a price is going to turn a person away if the value is not there. But if the value is there, if they can see a possibility and they can get over their own obstacles of like oh not me a real person coming like real people transforming is like it speaks a thousand words. It is literally what gets a person out of their head and into their heart and they start to feel it's possible to transform i mean do we have a product that can help people transform their lives do we have something that can like literally transform their lives we do and so we're not trying to manipulate people we're helping them move past their own obstacles, their fears, their trepidation, their doubts. Oh, I can't do it. Oh, I'm, I'm too attached to my 
sugar, my coffee, my alcohol, whatever the thing is, I could never give those things up. But if they can see somebody else did, someone else was able to let go of craving, someone else was able to make headway, someone else was able to transform their health and their business, their finances, right? If you guys don't have a story yet about transforming your finances, just borrow mine or anybody else until, until that doubt is finally like, okay, this is possible. That's why the Saturday morning calls are really helpful. It's just a reminder of like, oh, okay, you know, you can see like any of the people leading the calls have not always been in that position. We've all like struggled and like worked our way through it. So sharing stories about other people doing well in the business is another thing. That's what got me on board, you guys. I was like, I need a way to make income and I need a lot of income <laughs> for the lifestyle I want to live, but I needed to just simply like get out of my car. I needed, I needed a way to earn income that was not exhausting and taxing like wedding photography was. And so when I saw, when I was on this, when I was on my first connect call that Sarah had me on with Mele, Mele was my upline who, who was, who was doing the call for me and she had recovered from cancer. And I heard that people were making $20,000 a month in this business. That's what made me feel it was possible to make $20,000 in this business because I heard someone else did. Oh, okay. Then I might as well go for that. I had another friend who was making $9,000 a month in doTERRA. And I was like, how did she do that? I wasn't even in not network marketing yet. I was like, if she can do it, I can do it. You know, if my friend can do it, I can do it. If the possibility resides in the story, that's what makes things possible. So Going public is sharing the stories, is letting people know examples, giving them examples. And that's one of the reasons you bring a person to a connect call with me or your upline is because you may not have that many stories yet. You may not know that many stories yet, but when you hear myself or someone else sharing the stories, you'll start to know those stories and then you'll have those be will become your stories as well. But the connect call is where they're going to hear more stories. They'll hear your story and they're like, that's cool. That's cool. But then they hear another person's story. Wow, maybe there's something to this. And then they hear, hear about it. And then they hear a story about another, another person. They're like, huh, okay. Well, maybe I can give up. Maybe I will be able to get past my cravings. Maybe I will be able to do this. Maybe I can share this with my family. Maybe I can share this with my with my loved ones. Maybe, maybe I do have, maybe I can do the business. Maybe I can leave my job. Maybe I can finally like exit this crazy mayhem, lifestyle that's mayhem for me or like leave my toxic job, you know? Like maybe you gotta get the stories in there so that they feel inspired. So after G going public is the next letter in the acronym, which is A, ask the magic question. What is the magic question? Well, there's lots of magic questions. It's the question that seems relevant for that person at the time. Oh my God, look at that baby. Oh, so cute. <laughs> I see Lisa's got the baby now. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, oh, so sweet. So what is the magic question? One of the magic questions might be about, you know, like just finding out what their health is like. Another magic question could be like, you know, what do you love about your job or, you know, what, what, you know, what, what, what's the problem at work? Why are you not happy? What do you need? What are you happy with your work? What do you love about your work? What do you not love about your work? What's the, what's the life that you want to live? Are you living your full dream life? Are you living your life the way you want it? Is everything coming together for you? Get to know the person. It's not just one question. It's the series of questions, getting to know a person. Don't move so fast. Don't be so quick. Get to know the person so that you start to know what questions to ask. And then mirroring them. Oh, I hear you're, I hear that you really are like, you know, that you're making a good living, but you hate your job. Tell me more about that. Do you have an exit plan? 
have you ever thought of working for yourself? That's my favorite question is asking people, have you ever thought of working for yourself? Have you ever owned your own business? Have you ever thought about owning a different business? Get to know what is really important to them. Are you, you know, how is your, like, you know, why are you struggling at home? Oh, is it, are you exhausted? Are you, you know, how, how is your energy? What kind of, you know, do you feel like you're getting the nutrition you need? What are you doing about that? Oh, you have, oh, you have chronic fatigue. What have you tried that? What have you tried for that? We're not so immediately trying to tell them I have the pro I have the answer. Like, here's the thing. It's like, well, what are you doing about that? What have you tried? What has worked out? What has worked for you? What is not working for you? Like get, get them answering questions so that, so that it does two things. It helps you get to know them and it helps them get to know themselves, right? People don't know what their problem is. People don't even know that they have a problem. They've lived with it so long. They don't even see it anymore. Right? Bye, Tirza. <laughs> they don't even see it anymore. Oh, you were saying, you were saying that to Christian. Kristen. Yeah. Like they don't even see any, what their problem is anymore. So one of, you know, one of my side gigs that I, that I um, started doing a couple of years ago, as people know, is, um, my, my, my business creation program. Marketing is all about this. This is, <laughs> this is marketing 101A right here. You have to speak to the core challenge. You have to identify your niches, your, your niche. Who is your soulmate client? Like who is your soulmate client that you want to work with? What is their core challenge? You have to identify this for yourselves, you guys. What is their core challenge? And what is the outcome that you can promise? Or the outcome that you can deliver? Or the outcome that you want them to experience, feel? What is the outcome that they're going to have as a result of Purium? So who is your soulmate client and what is the outcome that you deliver? Now, have you, I know enough of, a, enough of us have been, you know, clicked on the clickbait on Instagram or so forth, where it's like, well, what is this person talking about? And then like, that now suddenly you're in their funnel. Now you're suddenly either buying, getting their free program or buying a free pro or buying a program for $27, right? And then what is that? Then they tell you what your problem is. They go, oh, are you, you know, are you tired of um, getting into people's DMs and cold calling? Oh, are you tired of this? Are you tired of that? Right. Like they say, are you tired of it? This is neuro-linguistic programming. They're getting into your head and speaking to your psychology. They're going into your shadowy thought and saying, you're sick of this, are you? Well, I got the solution. And so that's a, in a sense, when you're asking questions, you're doing that. You're getting into their head, helping them see what their problem is. Because a person, if they don't know what their problem is, then they won't know that you have the solution. And so you're helping them identify their problem by asking questions. And it's helping you identify their problem because you don't know if you have a solution for this person, quite honestly. Just because you think a person might be overweight or inflamed or in pain, and you might think like, oh, they need to get out of pain or they need to lose weight. That doesn't mean that's what they care about. They might not care about their weight. They might not care about like the pain. They're just like used to it. They're like, it's fine, it's fine. I can deal with that. If you ask them questions, you might find out the number one thing that they care about is getting nutrition in their kids' bodies before they go to school because they don't have time to make them breakfast. That could be their number one problem. And you thought it was all these other things. And if you didn't ask questions, you've missed it. You've missed the opportunity to help them got to ask the questions to know what they, what matters to them, not to you. So asking the magic question is all about getting to deeply know a person. And one of the things you do after you ask the question is you repeat back to them what you hear, right? Mirroring. 
Oh, wow. So yeah, you really um, have a hard time figuring out how to get nutrition into your kids. Okay. So that's really what's up for you right now. Okay. Got it. Nutrition, nutrition, like trying to get kid, nutrition to your kids. And then they're going to tell you their secondary problem because you, I, because now that you've acknowledged their first problem, you're like, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm just also not getting enough sleep. Like if I could just get enough sleep, then I could get up and like make them breakfast. Oh, so sleep's an issue. So you're also struggling with sleep. Yeah, I'm struggling with sleep. And, you know, I have a hard time like getting to bed on time. I have a hard time going to sleep. And, you know, really, I'm just like feeling so depressed. Oh, so you're depressed. If you just acknowledge a person, they will just keep telling you more and more. Just acknowledging them, mirroring them along the way, which I know actually all of you are good at. I know this comes naturally to a lot of you, but we want to do it even more. So the asking the questions and mirroring are all part of the same thing. When I'm on a connect call with people, that's what I'm doing the whole call. Asking questions and then mirroring them until we go deeper and deeper and deeper and we're more and more connected. And now I'm like, in, now I'm like in sync with them. By the time I've asked all these questions, now I'm like, okay, I'm getting their reality. I'm in sync. And now we have a vibe. And now the business is fun because I'm connecting. I'm having authentic connection with people. There's rapport now. There's real rapport. And that rapport is everything. Right? So we ask the magic question and then now there's this connection that's open and then we move them, M, move them through the system. Move them through the tools. So now we know all these things and then we're like, you know what? Can I send you a video? Like everything you're saying, there's this video where they talk about this woman, this friend of mine talks about how she recovered from blah, 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 or how she um, transformed her finances or whatever the thing is. Like I have a video for you. Can I send you a video? And then that's when we're going to move them through the tools. And so that's, here's the thing. It's like, we have so many tools, you guys. It's like, people don't know what tools to do anymore. It's like, what do I send people? Is anybody like wondering like, what, what should I send people? <laughs> right. Okay. We've got like all these hour long videos that I like half an hour to 45 minute long videos that I did. And some people are like, I don't want to send them a video that long. I don't feel like they're going to watch it. So what are you going to send them? So let me show you. Well, first of all, you can bring them into this group, moving them through the tools. One of them is the Core for Nutrition Launch Group. You can invite them and then tag them in videos and say, hey, I just tagged you in this video. Did you have time to watch it? You know, or I tagged you in this post. Did you have time to see it? Or I tagged you in three to five posts, you guys. This is why you guys all need to put your post in there. Can I, can I get a, can I, can I request this of you guys? Can people go in there and put their new stories in there, like updated stories? That would make such a huge difference. If all of you could put your updated stories in the Core 4 Nutrition group, then they'll all be current because everything in there is like 2017 and 23. And people are like, is anyone in this group? Is anyone using this group anymore? So if we get some new stories in there, that's going to light up that group. And then we'll have the ability to tag each other in each other's stories. And then we can also take those stories. We can, we can put them onto our, our pages as before and after pictures and submit them for share before you care. You can also post them in that group and submit them because that is our group and you're going public and you're sharing it in a public way. So even by sharing it in that group, you can get some points. Okay. So everybody get your points this week by sharing your stories in the core for nutrition group. And then you can take those and you can share them on your page for another for points next week. Yes. Dana Lynn. Is, so is that share because you, that would be share because you care. Yeah. That would qualify. Yep. I'm qualifying it here and now. <laughs> awesome. Self-qualifying. Honestly, they don't check the way people think they check. They just go, oh, she submitted something. It's like very general. And the share because you care group, honestly, you could get some brand partners. You could get some new customers or brand partners in that group because there's 20,000 people in there. You think they're all active? You think they've all ordered recently? A lot of them are free agents. You post in there, someone might just reach out to you. I've had people actually assign people up from that group because those people are like, people are putting people in there. You put people in there all the time. 
and half of those people never bought. So that's actually like a free agent that there's a lot of oper oper like people in that group that are free prospects. And as well as my Hashimoto's, my healing Hashimoto's naturally group, you're welcome to post your stories in there. Laura. Yes, hi. I wanted to ask, um, so let's say I don't really have the um, visible transformation, right? Because it was more like internal thing that happened. So should I just record a video of sharing about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. share your story. And then, and you can also just share a picture of your face too. Oh, and just write something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Thanks. Yeah. Good question. Anyone else? Go ahead, Marcy. Hi, Rachel. Alicia, my sister and I are going to be doing our first uh, official event table. And so I know that's a little bit different from what like you were talking about, because we're going to be, you know, face to face with the people with the products there. So um, do you have any tips as far as how far should I get into the product when people ask like, well, what is this? What you say is Put your name down here. I'm going to send you a $50 gift card off of anything in our superfood store. And you'll, and you'll also get a free, you'll get a free coaching call with me and I can talk to you and we can like talk about like what's, you know, available for you. Okay. So just keep it a little bit vague. Okay. Keep it short and quick, because honestly, you got a lot of people to get to. I had, we had 60 people, but you also want to build rapport with that person. So what I would do is I would focus on spending time questioning Stay in the ask the magic question phase. Stay in the rapport. Because if you sit there and ask a lot of questions, you're going to eventually know. You're going to eventually get the trust built. You're going to start to feel connected to them. And you're going to remember them. And they're going to remember you. So that when you do do that call, when you follow up with that call, they may ask you those questions. And if you have time, you can also go into it. Like there's, there's no problem with actually doing the whole presentation right there. I just would... Um, focus on if you do have the transformation now boxes though if you like have something to sell right there like that's like you could get buy three boxes and do the transformation now because like I had people to sell to when when Gleneth and I did our booth the other day we got at least 60 names at least 60 leads and I had three people ready to buy right there and I didn't have a box to sell them yeah I only have one I could only afford one I hear you <laughs> I hear <laughs> um Go ahead, Narenkar. Sorry. I'm what? sorry. I just know, you know, no. I think I just love your spiritual name. <laughs> Fine. I get it. Um, when, so when you say, um, you know, put your name here and I'll share a $50 gift card with you. Can you walk us through what that gift card is? Is it texting them our discount code? Is it give, is it doing a permalink? Like what is that? $50 gift card. Permalink. Okay, so it's a permalink to just the iShop page. Because here, what you're going to do is you're going to add the, all those names to the lead capture. First, you're going to add them to the lead capture, which is at purempermalinks.com. There's a lead capture. You're going to add all those names as soon as you get home to the lead capture, and they're going it, to it's going to instantly put them in a um, an email. They're going to instantly be in your funnel. Mm -hmm. and Purim instantly is going to send them an email. So that's where they're going to, so they're get, they're going to get something, right? They're going to get, you know, a link to a website. And then, but, but I really focus on like follow-up calls. Like I'll call you. I, I have, a, I, I added a column into the sheet that's like issue. And so that way I can write down like, you know, um, inflammation, pain, diabetes, you know, exhaustion, fatigue, I can write down a little note in there and I put my initial next to it. So I know which person talked to that person. So you're going to want to be like M for Marcy or A for Alicia. And then you'll have that way you'll know who's this who's because you do definitely want to be both enrolling, right? Yes. <clears throat> Another question. So, so essentially you're not going, you're the lead capture process is your $50 gift code because it's associated with you. So if they order, it's automatically associated with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's done. Because you, okay. 
Now, please ask them, is this what your email says? Because we had a few where we're like, what the heck is that email say? We have no idea. So every person who does it, I always go over and go, is this correct? Is that an Y? Is that an I? I just make sure I understand their email. Okay, awesome. I have to jump and pick my daughter up from school. Okay. Thank Great. you. We'll, we'll just hear this last thing because this is important. It's super important to offer them that you're like, say like, oh, I'm, I'll call you and we'll have a conversation about that. We'll do a little health coaching call with you. I have a protocol for that. I can talk to you about a protocol for that. But what you want to focus on is telling them the story. So if they say I have diabetes, you want to focus on a story of somebody who recovered. Okay. Not this is going to help you like, oh, wow, really you have that? Share stories at the event. Share as many stories as possible with people. And then you want to call them right away. I wouldn't focus on, I would call them rather than text them, call them, like set up a call time with them if they if you can. Call them to set up a call time or text them to set up a call time. Um, but getting on the phone is way more powerful. Okay. All right. Thank you. Appreciate you. You're welcome. Does anybody else have any questions? Rachel, I'm sorry, one more question on that. So um, is it okay to give them like the QR code that sends them to the um, lead form or should it always go to our, our you mean, shop here? Your, you mean give them the QR code at your booth? Yes. I mean, you can. I try to stay away from that because I don't know if they're going to do it. Okay, because they do need the referral code. I want to make sure I have their information. Right. Oh, I'm okay. Not, I'm not into giving them the referral code. I want to. I want to get their information so I can. Okay. Stay, I can stay in contact with them because I don't know that they're going to stay in contact with me. They may forget. They may lose the paper. Who knows? Okay. Yeah. Good tip. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. I thought you guys did one. Was it just a? Were you just practicing in your front lawn? Like what was that? Yeah, we were practicing in the front lawn to see how long it would take to set up. And then I try to call a neighbor over. And um, so, yeah, so just, you know, playing around. <laughs> so what I recommend is having a few pictures of before and after pictures out. Yes. So you can see that. And um, we found that nobody looked at the transformation now binder no one had time no one no, everyone was so so quickly moving through the booth it was like just the pictures and then just being like and then we would say hey would you like some liquid sunshine that's how we would draw people to do it would you like some liquid sunshine we like give them like a little dixie cup with the glass you know like hey would you like some liquid sunshine they're like what's liquid sunshine mm -hmm. or it's a conversation and then you say are you experiencing any of these things and then you just point to the sign hand them the sign are you experiencing even any of these things and they're like Usually they're like, yeah, isn't, doesn't everyone experience all of those? Yeah. <laughs> and then you tell your story. Yeah. And then you, oh, me too. I will. Here's my story. So focus on okay. your, sharing someone's story. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. It honestly takes less, pre it takes pre pressure off of that being on the spot going over the, the products and stuff so yeah. you're not I trying like to that. sell anything right there and then you're just really trying to make the first connection and then the, the rest is going to happen on a zoom or you can invite them to a zoom or you can tell them hey we're going to do a zoom call this friday if you'd like to come okay have something ready and set up and say i'll email you about the zoom i'll tell you about the zoom i'll send you a message about the zoom okay thank you and then i can send you the replay if you're not available okay but then the next step so so we so we're almost done and then i have yama here but so G A M E. So game. So um, going public, asking the magic question, moving them through the tools. All right, we got lots of different tools. Some of the tools are on the boards app. Um, the Q and A Saturday Zooms. Those are like the best tools. And I want since Yama's here, I really want to show that. So let me see if I can like actually share my screen. Oops, everything's like all these controls in the way. So um, so Yama did. Did you get the boards app? Did, were you able to like, get that on your phone or, or or do you have it on your computer or something? Yama, can you hear me? I know you're eating. Sorry. Um. Yeah, I didn't know that I was muted. Oh, okay. I have this, but I don't know how to use it because I wanted the videos. That's what I was interested in. Yeah. So that's, this is, this is perfect timing because that's what we were going to go over in our call with you. And so this is like an overlap so I can share with everybody. So this is the team alchemy resources. This is our app. 
And then if you go down here to Q&A Saturday replays, that's where all the videos are. So this is a video on literally everything under the sun. Um, this basically detox and nourish is kind of just like all about, you know, like aging through because of accumulation of toxins. And then um, you go down here, we've got Hashimoto's, menopause, multiple sclerosis, autism and anxiety, migraines, mm -hmm. eczema, diabetes, stomach pain, alopecia, hair loss, um, pain, Lyme, gout, fibromyalgia. Um, here's one in Japanese. Alzheimer's and dementia, acne, skin, MS and strep, digestive issues, IBS, GERD, et cetera, cancer, the root cause, um, the womb body, everything related to, from, to the womb, getting pregnant, you know, being becoming fertile, getting pregnant, um, having a baby, postpartum, menopause, perimenopause, postmenopause, um, uh, um, mold toxicity, autoimmune in the athlete. Um, here's the Purium products A through Z. This is like everything, like all of the different products, just in alphabetical order. Um, bones and heart health. So anybody who has like any kind of cardio issues, any kind of issues at all with their heart and any kind of issues at all with their bones, they're connected. I connect them here in this presentation. Very important for people to understand how they're connected. Um, overweight and underweight, Hashimoto's and fibromyalgia, um, Crohn's disease, the ULT parasite, pineal clear in the brain pack, Q&A support. So everything, there's so much here, fatty brain disorders, um, postpartum psychosis. I mean, like, it's amazing. The resources are here. Epstein, here's something that's entirely on Epstein-Barr virus. It's in a, it's in a, it doesn't look like a video, but if you open it up, it has two videos, part one and part two, Epstein-Barr virus. So everything practically is here that you could possibly need. Uh, the only thing to know is that this here, this ULT, be energetic with, um, Tevia, this is a very different video than all the rest because this is just a six minute video that explains just the products. So if you're like, somebody's in a hurry and you just wanna show them the products, this only goes over the 30 day, but he does it very, very well. He does the ULT plus B energetic because we always believe that that's good for energy. Um, so if you listen to this, you can see it's only, it's actually nine minutes long. Okay. So detail over every product. You can see, like he put the pot products pop up on the screen and you can see them as he talks about them. So this is one to share with somebody who's just like trying to understand what's in it. But really for most people, if you don't know what to send them and they don't seem to have any issues, just send them the detox and nourish video because this one's very generic. It's all about why we should detox, which is just generally that we're getting poisoned every day. We're exposed to glyphosate every day. We're exposed to toxins every day. Um, I bust, I think in this one, I, I like bust the myth about like, you know, people getting like, oh, I'm getting old and I'm like, you know, I, oh, I'm in pain, but it's okay. It's cause I'm old. I'm aging. I'm like, no, it's not about aging. It's accumulation, accumulation of toxins over time. No one has to feel sick when they're old. No one has to feel sick when they die. No one has to die going out because they're decrepit. That is such a modern day belief because everyone has gotten so sick nowadays. So now everyone just associates sickness and aging as if they're the same thing. They're not. People age, people are 90 and hiking. People are 110 and dancing. I mean, look at um, raw food Christina's. Her, her grandfather is 110, 110 years old dancing with her. So um, that's what's on the Q&A Saturdays is all these videos. Um, and so again, the most generic one is this top right one. That's why it's here. Um, oops, I don't know what I just did. But anyway, and then on the left is introducing Rachel Balance at. I created this because some of you want to get somebody on a connect call with me. They're like, who's Rachel? You're like, let me just tell you really quick. And so if you just press this, <laughs> like, this is, yeah, this is literally like five minutes of me introducing myself. Hey, they're amazing people. I just wanted to introduce myself. Mm -hmm. My name is Rachel Balance at, and I am a regenerative health practitioner. I'm also a clinical iridologist, and I also practice Ayurvedic nutrition, which is East Indian medicine. And I just wanted to let you know who I am because I have aligned with a company that has a product that is incredibly helpful for all my clients, everyone that I see, my patients. And this is uh, something that 
someone will probably be sending some information to you about who's a health coach on my team. And I just wanted you to know that I endorse this product. It's a cleanse, it's a detox, it detoxes the liver, it detoxes the gut, and it helps people with their digestion. I have found that it really helps my clients get to where they're going a lot faster. And so I just wanted to make this quick video so that you would have some understanding of why this person is sharing this video with you. So I wanted to let you know that what's unique is that we do suggest this protocol and you'll see that we also will make suggestions for other supplements sometimes from another company and that we also have a protocol like a plant-based food protocol that goes along with this. Now, if you're not plant-based, it's okay. We can also customize it according to if you want to be eating meat. If that is something that's really important to you, we can do that as well. It's just that people have better results and faster if they go plant-based, but we will accustom anything to your particular needs. And I just wanted to say that this, this protocol has been life-changing for me, and that is why I got on board and began representing this company. Uh, I personally had Hashimoto's. I struggled with my health for nine years, and even as, as I became a health practitioner, I was trying to find ways to help and this was the one thing that made the biggest impact. And that is why I now represent it. So you can know that I have vetted this company. It is all organic. It is very pure. The farms are regenerative, which means that they actually practice really healthy farming, that it is they're good to the soil. They compost after every harvest. Everything's organic. The land where all of these plants have been planted are on land that has never actually seen any pesticides or herbicides. So it is completely safe the way it is farmed. They also, they rotate crops and they compost after every harvest. So they're returning the nutrients back to the soil because you are what your food eats. And so it is very important that the food you eat is coming out of extremely healthy soils. And I can guarantee that this company does that. A little interesting story about Dave Sandoval, the founder, is that he and his partner who created the company were the lobbyists who helped get our nation the organic food label, the USDA organic food label. So if you shop with that label in mind and you're trying to buy organic and you make sure that everything you buy has that label on it, you can thank these people for pioneering, for lobbying, for making it possible for us to actually have organic produce and for us to be informed and know that our produce is organic. Why is this so important? because pesticides and herbicides are causing a huge amount of illness in our country and outside of our country. So everywhere in the world is dealing with pesticides and herbicides. And these things are so toxic that they are creating disease around the planet. It is extremely important that we detox from those things. And it is also extremely important that we shop for food that is as organic as possible. Now, not everyone of us can, but we want to do our best. But just to reiterate, there are several components of this protocol that I'm recommending. And part of it is these superfoods that are very helpful, that have been incredibly effective. And then part of it is a protocol of how you eat during this, during this 90 days. There's like a food-based protocol that is incredible, that is just absolutely Perfect. I dare say so myself. <laughs> we can customize again according to your particular needs. So I'll probably be called in to talk to you at some point, or somebody will be called, one of the coaches will be called in to talk to you at some point about following the regimen and uh, making sure that you have success and customizing it to any allergies you have or any food needs that you have. So that's how we work here. So just wanted to give you that little tidbit. And last but not least, there is a money back guarantee on the 90 day protocol of superfoods that you are going to purchase if you choose to do that. You could just choose to do the foods and although you'll be, you'll be happy sooner and you'll feel better sooner if you actually follow the protocol. So there is a 60 day money back guarantee on the protocol. And so there's really no risk. You might as well try it. And if you have 60 days and you start to feel better, Hooray. And if not, you can send it back. No questions asked. Money back guarantee. All right. Have a beautiful day. Thanks. So how many people have actually seen that before? Michelle's watched it. Does that feel helpful to you to have that? Okay. Okay, good. So the last step of, of the methodology for moving people through the tools. So I'm just going to reiterate, because this is also for Yama. This is what I was going to go over on the call with you, Yama. So I just kind of want to say it to as many people as possible. Thank you. Um, so, so, the method, so the method of helping people is really to 
um, share stories. So going public just means sharing a story. So the game plan, G-A-M-E is the acronym for going public, asking the magic question, moving them through the tools and then enrolling. So E is enroll. So you enroll them in the, in the, in, with the subscription. Yeah. Um, so the game plan is sharing a story because stories, people, people aren't people, you might think people are interested in products, but products is just getting into their head. It's not getting into their heart. It's not going to help them feel like they can overcome their own obstacles. We're here to help them believe that they can overcome their own obstacles, which is cravings or habits, things that people think that are gonna dominate them and they're not gonna be successful. So by sharing stories, we're helping encourage them. This is your way of encouraging them. Sharing stories is encouraging people and helping them feel that it's possible to change their health and um, and change their habits. So that's, so that's G, A is asking the magic questions and we've went over all the questions, which is like really getting to know a person, a person not what we, think what we want for them, but to find out what's really actually most important to them, because um, what's important to us, what we may think we want to help. I might be like, think I want to help my mom with her arthritis, but it might not be her most important thing for her. Her most important thing might be energy. So we just need to make sure that we're really in touch with the person's true, true desires so that we're helping them achieve the results based from, based on what is important to them. So that's why we ask questions, ask questions, ask questions and mirror them, show them that we understand. And then as we mirror them more, they'll reveal more. And then M is move them through the tools. We went over all the tools, the core, you can add them to the core four nutrition group where you can actually tag them and um, in posts where other with other similar stories like diabetes, Lyme disease, you name it, you can like share with them all kinds of stuff there. Um, and then that way they can like get really excited about the stories they see there. The other tools are like I just showed you on the boards app. Um, which is the uh, Q and A Saturdays folder where there's lots of videos there. Um, there's also the there's also um, another thing that I really like to do that I feel like this is really helpful because visual. Some people are very visual, and what's useful is showing them. If you go down here to step two, inspire before and after. These are the steps. So step one is inquire, step two, inspire, step three, inform, step four, invite to a call. But step two, inspire before and after. This is where it's very helpful visually sometimes for someone just to see this. Like, wow, look at this person, like not just lost weight, but she's glowing, she's happy. She just looks so much more thriving. Showing people stories of like, here's somebody with like chemo poisoning, right? This is Mele, the first person I met and her chemo poisoning and her, and her skin clearing up. Um, maybe you have somebody with acne. It's visuals for some people is going to be a lot more than just telling a story. And then here's someone who lost 200 pounds in one year who lives in Sonoma County. Um, here's somebody who recovered from erectile dysfunction and um, and heart heart um, uh, heart blood pressure, high blood pressure, and various other things. Um, here's somebody who recovered completely. From diabetes so he's diabetic in picture one not diabetic at all not even just like just but just completely not diabetic um and you know he's lost 60 pounds and and so on right so and then here's somebody who's lost weight it's like sometimes people just need to see things to really you know to really get what's possible for them and so that's why these tools are here and why they're so important so you've got the core for nutrition group you've got the team alchemy resources you've got the q a saturday replace and then you got the inspire before and after. These are like the two most powerful folders in our entire repertoire. Those are gonna get you the most. And then if you wanna help hold the table, if you wanna have the table, um, there's the event booth set up right here. For health consultations, there's questions and answers about everything. Uh, you can go in here and geek out, but you know, protocols for all these different things. And that's it. That's all I wanted to show you today was those. If you're going, if you have someone in Europe, there's the Europe folder. So um, all these things are available. And so that's it. And then the next one is just enroll. And obviously, maybe it's not so obvious. Um, uh, at some point, you want to get them on a connect call at the end, right? So it's like invite them to a call. So enrolling is like invite them to a call with your upline, um, whoever in your upline you feel like bringing them to. 
and then we will help you um, get them enrolled. And that's it. So thank you all for staying on so long, those of you who did, and we'll complete there. Any other questions? Any questions about any of this before I stop and we go to and before Shri and I start our call with Yama? Okay. Have a great day, you guys. Thanks for being here. Blessings. Thank you. <laughs>